Today we are measuring the wake produced by our P12 ferry as well as that of a comparable 30 passenger displacement ferry. We're going to be running our P12 ferry next to this pier and measuring using sensors in collaboration with the university to show that the P12 produces much less wake than a similar sized passenger vessel. We're hoping that by presenting these results to local authorities, we will be able to run Candela above the local speed limit, cutting the commute time in half for many ferry passengers. Now we're here on the pier and we're set everything up and we're gonna log the data and do several test runs. We have been working on this uh, radar sensor as our master thesis project at KTH Mechatronics. Now we're using it in this project to measure the wave height in a comparative way between the Candela P12 ferry and the traditional ferry to see how much the difference is in the wave heights. Most boats work by displacing their own weight in water. As they move through the water, they produce a wave that's called wake. The faster a boat goes, or the heavier the boat is, the more wake is produced. This means that if you want to carry many passengers at a high speed, you end up producing very large waves and putting a large amount of energy just into moving water. Large wakes can be damaging to the shoreline, causing erosion of environmental and man-made shores. Wakes can also be a danger to the other users of the waterway, including uh, small boaters, swimmers, uh, paddle boarders, and other uh, small and unstable craft. Because the P-12 flies through the water on a foil rather than displacing water and creating wake, it is able to go at much higher speeds without creating a dangerous amount of waves. If a candle boat makes the same wake as a traditional boat makes at 5 knots, when it is going in 15 or 20 knots, then it can go at 4 times the speed with the same wake, and then they can actually also commute at 4 times the speed. Observing the results today of the wakes caused by the reference vessel and the Candela P12, it's very impressive to see that the Candela causes much less wakes. It's obvious that the energy is lower and the impact should be a lot smaller. Working with innovation projects like this, it's very important for us. And there are several aspects what we can learn from this. There are sustainable values, there are also economical values. And using the waterways more efficiently could lead to a very positive effect of the citizens and a more effective transportation system.